and we are back thanks guys for clicking on the video please like subscribe comment below share the video i'm trying to get my tennis channel back to where it was before but this is good energy we may discuss all types of things here uh we're at the chicago invitational here uh wta 500 event uh some big names in this event great matchup here on shabar coming through uh over a upset over elena svetlana and she's facing uh, elena rabakina today uh elena ran into um some injury problems here she dropped the first set 6-4 and got broken in the second set uh Anz was up 3-2 and elena could not she just could not go anymore uh Anz having a really good year 40 and 16 on an, on the year winning her um lone singles title this year um 30 and 19 for rabakina on the year pretty decent year for her very active year for both ladies Anz, that is not Chun Li from Street Fighter, guys. That's Anz Jabbar, okay? Um, very, very good tennis player, consistent. Uh, not as athletic as some of the other ladies on tour, but she um, she has very good net play, and she's very versatile. She's very, um, she she can move. So, you know, don't think that she's not athletic, um, you know, counter uh counter my last statement there but she is she is very fit she's very game and she's a smart tennis player and um i mean she's ranked uh 16th in the world so she can beat anyone in the top 10 any given day um so Anz advances she will face um garbinia muguruza and that's going to be a really good matchup um vandrosova could not continue today so that was a uh, that was a walkover for Garbenia uh Vanderosa who silver medalist in Tokyo uh, very good year as well uh a sleeper she kind of i mean those that watch tennis know of her but she definitely came out of left field with the silver medal and then she was actually the favorite to win the gold um but um Belinda Bensick was able to uh edge her out on that one so Anz and Garbenia tomorrow, uh, that will be a championship. And that's going to be interesting. Um, I think Garbenia is going to be too strong. But uh, stay tuned. We'll keep you posted on that. And, uh, hey, what do you think of this matchup? Um, do you think uh, Garbenia will finish Anz in straight sets? Or do you think uh, Anz has the ability to take it a third set or take care of Garbenia in two sets? Um I have Garbenia winning this matchup. I think her serve is going to be too much. I think that is just going to put too much pressure on Anz to produce, and I could see a lot of unforced errors. Let me know what you think.